Welcome to Global Insiders Podcast. I am Ryan, the Peripathetic One, bringing you information about opportunities relating to jobs, traveling, and any information that can elevate you to your rightful place in this thing called life. You can find more information and how to methods on globalinsidersgroup.com. That is insiders with an S. And here is today's show. Hello, insiders. Welcome to another show today. Today, I want to talk about a very important topic that affects all of us at some point in our lives. Talk about unemployment. What do you do when you're unemployed? I don't know how many of you have felt depression from being unemployed, but it is a horrible thing that I hope you will never have to experience. This unknowing and frustrating state might come into your life because you have just finished school or you might have gotten laid off or maybe your contract might have just ended. Whatever the reason is, being unemployed is definitely a frustrating state to be in. So whatever the reason, the feeling is still the same. This is especially true if you do not have savings. I have experienced unemployment in several ways in the past. I remember when I returned from the state time after doing my J1 program. I was unemployed for several months. I really wanted to get going again, but things just weren't happening for me. And the good thing is I had savings at that point. I mean, contrast that with when I just um, graduated from university. I mean, then I didn't have any savings. So the level of frustration was much higher. In fact, I went through a period of depression because I thought that I would have been back in school to do my master's but it so happened that the master's program that I had applied for they decided to to pause that program for that year and um, I was looking at a situation where I would have where I would have to stay home for one year and that definitely was not my plan so I really did not know what to do so I was unemployed and I had absolutely um, no idea what to do at the time. And um, luckily, a friend stepped in maybe a month after I went through maybe two or three days of deep depression, which I didn't even realize. It was um, my mother who pointed it out to me that, you know, you're really not looking like yourself or you're not behaving like yourself. So, um you need to snap out of it. You need to to do something and to get back, get back your joy, you know. So I definitely can identify with you if you are going through a period of um, depression because of the fact that you are not employed. So, as I said, of course, like most people, after leaving university, I did not have a job, and um, I just really wish I could fix that that period i could go back in time and um and just tell that young man listen you will get through this don't don't be depressed you know don't be don't don't be too hard on yourself it's not your fault you know but um i can't go back in time but in the meantime though i will share some things that i've uh, that i have learned while being unemployed so if you are like me you will feel a great amount of desperation and self-pity when you are unemployed my word um to you is this first of all don't allow these emotions to get the best of you and second don't waste these emotions i know this might sound strange but listen emotions hide reality 
and for this reason we shouldn't make serious decisions when we are on an emotional high or low i know that this is easier said than done but if you can control the situation you will definitely have a better chance of making the making it work for you what do i mean by this well when you are unemployed um your brain begins to process many things i mean things such as um, sadness anxiousness and sometimes full out depression um we begin to wonder how soon um we will get back in the working world and you know things of that nature um some rational thoughts will come across our minds but most of them if we are honest with ourselves are irrational like i'll never be employed again or um it, it's all my fault i mean i didn't do the right thing i didn't study the right thing i mean i should have done something else i should should have looked looked in other places for my opportunities instead of where um we did so the mind definitely will play tricks on us so we have to be on the lookout for that um this problem occurs because we are programmed to do yes human beings are programmed to do things um if we do not do something with our lives and bodies we will experience atrophy um our brains are obviously keen on this and as a result it constantly keeps going so we must do um so th- th- that's a dilemma i mean so we need to do things but on the other hand we don't have a job you know so how can we keep on doing when we are unemployed well for starters we should s- up start applying for a new job as soon as we find the energy to get going i say find the energy because um when you are down when you are feeling really down i mean you really lack willpower and what i've noticed over the years is that it is good to mourn it is good to to stop it is good to to take a minute and um feel sad i mean i'm not going to tell you not to feel sad i mean i think that the feeling is a f- it's it's an emotion that must be dealt with and it at times must be felt you know so that you can truly enjoy um the beautiful feeling of joy when it gets back in your spirit so um therefore suggest that you learn a truth that is hardly spoken you have to realize that though being gainfully employed is a great thing it is often not our purpose for living sometimes our jobs don't even excite us if you are not excited and passionate about life it is easy for it to become a drudge so it is with this in mind that we should ensure that we do not lose the opportunity to find our passion when we are unemployed so stop worrying about a situation that is not your fault that is being unemployed yes being unemployed is not your fault at all and start working on getting employed Yes, we have to search for a job, but whatever else time that is left should be used to do things that we love. So, I would suggest that um try to read a book, try to read books that you you you, you didn't get a chance to read while you were working or while you were in school. Um revisit and try to do courses that weren't available in the past or the ones that you didn't really do well in uh, while you were at university, you know, so you can um gain a great amount of um skills in the in those areas and um here i would would also recommend um websites such as khan academy and alison i mean both of these websites have uh, many free online courses so you know just to get back your groove and to get your feeling of of of, of um mastery to an extent of the things that you did before or to gain new skills in areas that uh, maybe you were interested in or just to gain new skills overall um catch up with friends who you did not have time for while you were studying or while you were working i mean you know we are 
human beings and we definitely need to we definitely need to to speak to to others and to um we need company we need um as this as the saying goes no man is an island you know and i'm sure no woman is an island also so definitely um communicate with others you know and and get that get that spirit that get that community spirit working for you all right also just make the best of being in control of your time i mean set a schedule a schedule you know set a daily schedule i mean yes you you you're home and maybe you know uh, if depending on your situation you might be home with your parents or home with your your spouse and you know they will definitely start looking at you a particular way if you're unemployed for a very long time but you know what is beyond your control is beyond your control but you definitely can set yourself set a schedule and start um working towards some sort of goal so set some small goals i remember um the last time when i was unemployed i i had a nice list on my on my wall i would do things like um excel and some things in microsoft word and um i didn't do any coding at that time but yes i would get up in the mornings and i think the routine went something like i'd get up and do some chores and then i'd read a book i was reading some self help books at the time and you know more like listening rather but yes i was using self help books doing something i was planning i had something to do each day and um yes it worked for me it it gave me gave me um you know it gave me some to just get going you know i think i built a a small stone wall at the time too nothing nothing big just a small stone wall you know just to show that you know as they say one it doesn't you don't have to 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 do a big thing one time but just each day doing a small thing can get you can get you somewhere so yes i did that while i was unemployed you know so last but not least start a hobby you know definitely this this is something i absolutely believe in you know get a hobby if you don't have a hobby start one and make sure that it's something that can help you to develop a skill because you don't want to waste your time you want to make sure that um whatever you're you're spending your time with can can help you to move forward so as i said at the start don't let these emotions come and go use them to build a new you and to experience new things in this world all right so if you're feeling sad and down or depressed from being um unemployed just try to use the emotions of sadness to 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 regain some joy in your life all right and how you do that is by definitely feeling the moment of sadness and then making plans and building a routine around small things that can help you to get some impetus get some motion going in your life thank you Thanks for listening today. I hope you are inspired. You can find more helpful and motivational material at globalinsidersgroup.com. That is insiders with an S. You can also keep in touch at Global Insiders on Instagram. See you next time. But remember, you can be your own superhero. <laughs> Bye.